It's game night here in South Brooklyn, but for the first time, it's professional women ice hockey players that the crowds are here to see. Named after iconic World War II worker Rosie the Riveter, the New York Riveters play at a former wartime airbase. They're one of four teams in the National Women's Ice Hockey League, the first ever salaried league for women in the US. While the NWHL is new, the Riveters already have plenty of fans. I like seeing the girls play. It feels like, like girls are getting more out there and stuff, so instead of the guys, girls could do it too. It's really good that the world has accepted that not only boys can play hockey, that women can be fierce and awesome too. The USA women's team is often on the podium at the Winter Olympics, but until now players have had to rely on sponsorship and day jobs to make their passion pay. Riveters forward Madison Packer appreciates the newfound recognition. Yeah, I think this is the first time that we've really gotten interest, gotten people interested in the game, people um, wanting to come out and support us, and first opportunity in the States at least that we have to be professional athletes and get paid for what we're doing, so it's pretty special. In the team's first home game, visitors Boston Pride got the better of the Riveters, but the players here are in this for the long haul and hope that their biggest achievement will be inspiring more girls to get on the ice in the years to come.